Ladies and gentlemen, let's pretend that it's October 29th, 1993 in Japan. You just got done playing Rockman 6 for the end of for the Famicom and for its home computer. Family, family, that was redundant. And now you're playing Rockman World 4 on the Game Boy. This introduction was a botch. Job. I'm sorry. I tried. Anyway, this is Let's Take On 30. Zero thirty, excuse me. Roll Jan four. Honestly, my point was, you know, this was released on October 29th of 1993, and the last Game Boy game was released on December 11th, 1992, and the final NES game was released on October 5th. I mean, if you like Mega Man, Rock Man games, you were pretty much set in the 90s. Because these suckers released just bam, bam, bam. And here we're introduced to a mysterious new robot, as is the tradition of these Game Boy games. Roll's not gonna stand for that, though. Wake up. Now. Roll. Dr. Wyoway has sent his most powerful robots across the world to combat them. Sorry. That's gonna be loud on the recording. To combat them, I've invented a new machine to make power items for you. But to make the items, we need to use this. We need to use special enemy e energy items called P chips. Collect as many P chips as you can and bring them back to the web. The more chips you collect, the better the item I can make for you. Okay. Alright. Let's start with Pharaoh Man because up, down, left, right. He's a man! Ow. Oh, the slowdown is already in a full effect. Oh, no. Get spoiled by the NES games. And then I go back to playing this, and I'm like, oh no. So, let's see, if I remember correctly, yep. You get a different kind of like, uh, you get a different sort of buster in this game. It's not the new Buster. It's not the Super Buster. It's really not named at all. But it does have some kickback to it, so... And as I no doubt mentioned on, uh... Oops, hold on. Right. And as I no doubt mentioned the first time I played this for my channel, which, yes, it's a repeat, and I'm sorry. That's was bound to happen during a marathon of these games. But the first, like I mentioned the first time I played this for the channel, you can actually upgrade the uh, Buster in this game just by being really bad at it. Namely, if you uh, continue the same stage three times, I believe, then Dr. Light will upgrade your Buster so it's a wide shot. I think it's only one upgrade in this game. But he might do it twice, I don't quite remember. Oh, 
There we go. That's the rate of fire I was trying to go for. You know, lag withstanding. Ugh. People who made this game, you know? I mean, they must have known that the game was laggy. Right? Right? And again, just because it's laggy does not mean it's terrible. No, quite on the contrary. This is actually where the games start having, like, actual storyline in them. Oh man. I want that. But I know it's a trap. Actually... Ugh! Idiot. Now if I slid jump, which actually works in this game, might have been able to do something with that. Speaking of sliding, I should do that more often anyway. Make the game go a little faster. Well, make it seem like the game's going faster. Anyway, I don't believe I'll be going after that uh, one-up this time. I mean, especially if I get knocked into a pit. Because I'm too impatient! Can you blame me with this game, though? I mean, honestly. about this game. Uh, no, I don't think I do. I thought about it. I thought about going after it. But I mean, I'm here. So. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a bit, bit of trivia, kind of obvious. New rendition of the boss tune. Which I, you know, didn't let play, but... I'm sure you heard a little of it. I mean, they absolutely didn't need to do that. But they did. So, you know... Kudos to them. You remember in uh, Mega Man 6, I said they were started. They started introducing how to, you know, and this password system. Oh my good golly gosh! Anyway. So yeah, they demonstrate the weapons in this game, too, so that's neat. He's a man! I'll stop doing that. It's a very empty opening to the stage, I have to say. Why did that happen? That was a one-by-one one pit. 
Guys who made this game, you failed it. I should have been able to slide over that. And you know what? I'm gonna attempt it again. See, that's what's supposed to happen. I guess it's one of those, you know, linked sort of things. Like, I ran out of slide speed or something. Wow, Pharaoh Shot is really good in this game. Pharaoh Shot is really good in this game. problem with Throw Shot is that it... Surprisingly, nothing in there is that it doesn't go straight up. It never has had the ability to go straight up, though. Unlike, you know, the, uh, Base Buster. Oh, thank goodness. I don't have to wait. Goodbye. Good as you are, you have no business being in my way. Okay, well, I've done it. Or so I thought. Hey, let's do the thing. Wait, hold on. I gotta get one pick. Uh, spawn is actually on this screen, so that's too bad. Where'd I go? Nothing? Tra la la. Tra la la. Hey, uh, let's check the pea chips for. That's 50? That's it? Well. Hi, Toad Man. Hey, no, no, bad Toad Man. Now I shall be the rainmaker, for I have got rain flush. And also Tango Coil. Running gag. Shot isn't that good in this stage. What a heartbreak. In fact, if I remember correctly, I used Rain Flush a lot in this game stage, didn't I? I guess you could say it's... Now you know what that reference wouldn't make sense, never mind.
I've done a dumb. So fair shots, all right. And then what are you talking about? level. Oh, I want that, though. I need you to go away. Well, that was not effective at all. That was less effective somehow. That's fine. I got it. Wait, what? I guess that scooter booter thing. Uh, ah! Came back onto the screen just enough for me to smack it. Thank you. Let me see if I can make this. Wait, wait. Ah! Nope. It is impossible. I'm sure to save some of that Pharaoh shot for this. Go away. Well, I've got Pharaoh shot now. Uh, yeah, let's grab it. Why not? Who missed? Guess who almost missed twice? I take it back. That's sneaky. Stage like these, some, a lot of these stages are just kind of, you know, endurance sort of things. Wow, that thing is tougher than I remember. And I'm gonna have to fight it again. But I've got more life energy now. Screw you guys. Fan game makers, you you see what the Gabby Obi is doing? You, all right. <laughs> I ran that into the ground in Mega Man 2. I don't need to do it here. Oh, you you cheat. Not how you're supposed to toss rings. Yeah, this seems to be working. That knockback actually is kind of useful sometimes.
you got Ring Boomerang, which is another extremely useful weapon in this game. As I no doubt demonstrated in my other playthrough. Uh, Ring Boomerang can grab things. See? Let's test something real quick. Let's see if they got this right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. I get the feeling that they didn't bother. Because, I mean, why would you, you know, leave the lights off? There's a Dawn Pan right there. That's actually kind of disappointing, guys. I guess it doesn't work on half e a quarter E tanks. Or E tanks are possibly one ups. How are we doing on E tank? Okay. I got two and a half. I kind of wish you could use those quarter E tanks. That'd be nice. Alright, maybe I should have switched to Pharaoh Shot there. Ah, uh, if only I had the jet. I mean, sure, if you want to use this enemy here. Not really much point, though. Ah, the gut slips. Wait, are these ones that I smack, or... No, they... no never mind. They're gonna have a different game. Wait, how do I... Uh-oh. Oh. I thought it was a little less clever than that. I'm... skittish about dragging those all the way down. Now, I feel like I mentioned this in a preview... In Again, I keep referencing the previous playthrough. But I feel like I mention it there. Like, when the lights go off. Like, the 100 Wattens, right? They turn the lights off, right? Well, what about all the rest of these lights? Well, I was either overthinking it or not thinking, it, thinking about it enough. Because, you know... They... It's a light switch. It's a light switch, for crying out loud. It switches off all the lights. I might also be thinking of the, uh, fourth Mega Man game. Wow, alright. Throw shot does not work really well on those. I mean, neither does Ring Boomerang particularly, but... Oh ho ho! Almost got me. I actually didn't have any furrow shot. Nah, you're just being an idiot. An idiot. You have furrow shot. So I guess one big difference between this and the NES stage counterpart, NES counterpart, whatever, is that, uh, oh, I missed my opportunity to play with the lifts again. 
is that uh, since the 100 watts are, you know, turn the lights off completely, I can actually afford something now. Uh, you need to have more Dawn Pan enemies. Well, he still hurts, but he doesn't hit like a truck now, at least. Well, actually, yeah, I guess he can. Still kind of does. Ugh. That's a four robot masters down. Art that Zenk did for these games, I really do. I cannot stress how much I love these this art. You got Flash Stopper. Not Bright Stopper, not Time Stopper, Flash Stopper. You got Beat. No, I didn't. I won. Oh, sorry, bad joke. Alright, let's go to Dr. Light's lab. No, let's not. Parallax going? If he went there, why did we go here? Also, I just want to point this out again. Watch what happens. A handful of half-charged shots took this thing down and made it immobile. Come on, then. You're actually weak to ring boomerang, I believe. Are you weak to beat? No, but... It's a very lazy way to do that. You're not weak to ring boomerang either. Ugh! So much for my no damage clear. Yeah, that's the weakness. I'm okay with that. Goodbye. I'm sad there's nothing up there. Actually, why am I using that? I don't know. Yeah? Know that, but that would have been funny. Hello, Wiley. Hello, thing. Like, 
Yeah. Good fight. See ya. Ahem. Ahem! Yo! Oh! Want to trade your P-chips? So what okay, item you want? How's about this funny looking thing here? Are you finished? We web? No? I hit the wrong button. For this last item, the weapon with the lowest energy level will automatically be refilled when you pick up a weapon capsule. You need 150 P chips. Ah. Uh, you don't have enough P chips. Get lost. All of your weapons will be immediately recharged. You need 80 P chips for this item. Do you want to create this item? No. You want another item? Uh, not right now. Good luck, Paul.